Bangkok, the bustling metropolis of Southeast Asia, is a city on the edge. With a population of over 12 million people and sinking land, it's a place where the future is uncertain. In just a few short years, Bangkok could be abandoned, left to sink into the abyss of the sea. How did it come to this? What forces are driving the city towards its perilous fate? And what does it all mean for the people of Bangkok? Join us as we take a deep dive into the sinking city of Bangkok, exploring its history, its present, and its uncertain future. Bangkok's soft soil and urbanization. Bangkok is slowly sinking into the soft clay on which it was built. The city was established on a swampy coastline, and since then it has been transformed into a concrete jungle filled with skyscrapers and highways. The excessive weight of these modern marvels has been pressing down on the already unstable clay foundation, causing it to descend by up to 5.3 centimeters each year. The rapid urbanization of the Chao Phraya River Delta has had a significant impact on Bangkok's infrastructure. Canals, which used to be the city's lifeline, were replaced with business districts and vast suburbs. The land that once absorbed floodwaters has been paved over, adding even more weight to the sinking city. The weight of Bangkok has grown to a point where the soft soil beneath it can no longer bear its burden. The ground is giving way, and the city is sinking at an alarming rate. Illegal groundwater tapping and rising sea levels. Illegal tapping of groundwater is another major factor causing Bangkok to sink. Many of the city's residents have been continuously pumping up groundwater, removing a natural layer and resulting in further destabilization of the soil. This has caused the city to sink faster, making it more vulnerable to flooding. Rising sea levels due to global warming have been yet another factor, eroding the coastline at a rate of 4 centimeters a year. The increasing severity of monsoon rains has also led to longer and more devastating floods. The government's response during this time has proven inadequate, with a lack of clear policy doing little to help the overall situation. Sea walls have been almost useless due to the increasing erosion of the shore. The lowering of the city, combined with rising sea levels, has resulted in whole districts of Bangkok being permanently abandoned. Over a million buildings, the majority residential, are rendered uninhabitable, forcing their occupants to move further inland. Many areas that have yet to be fully claimed by the sea have also been evacuated, as the regularity of flooding proved too costly for many. The future of Bangkok? As more and more of the city is permanently flooded, the situation for Bangkok will only worsen in the coming years. By the early 2030s, large portions of the megalopolis will be well below sea level, and the government's response will have to change. Efforts are underway to save Bangkok's numerous historical monuments and artifacts, with some temples being moved inland and reconstructed in their entirety. However, due to the scale of this disaster, much is lost. The economic and social upheaval in the region is having a significant impact on global GDP. Shanty towns and refugee camps are forming outside the city, while the government struggles to adjust as the capital sinks. Thailand as a whole is going through a period of almost unimaginable stress at this time, a result of such huge population displacement. By the end of this century, the entire city will be abandoned, and Bangkok's story will be one of a once vibrant city that succumbed to the forces of nature and human development. That's all for this video. Please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications to stay informed about future videos. Until then, take care. Thank you for watching.